Oh no, we're dealing with AC circuits once again. Not a bad problem though. Let's see. So we have a thousand ohm resistor, classic, uh, two milli Henry inductor, another classic. Um, and we have a frequency of 1,000 radians per second. Well, thank God they put in radians per second because that's really convenient. It's not like RPM or something. But why would you have RPM for a circuit? I don't know. Um, and we're trying to find the impedance combination of this whole thing. Well, let me tell you one thing. you got to remember the Laplacian transformations of these uh, bad boys, of these uh, electrical components. So... And what I'm saying is, like, what is the impedance, impedance, um, that's the correct uh, pronunciation of the word, what is the impedance of the uh, ohm resistor? Well, let me tell you, the resistance and impedance of a resistor is the same thing. So I'm saying 1,000 ohm is the same thing in terms of impedance. It's the same value, the resistance in AC circuits, so to speak. But, unfortunately, for inductors and capacitors and all those weird electrical components fundamentally have something different when it comes to impedance. So, for the inductor, I don't know what to give it. Um, oh, yeah, L. L is the symbol for inductance. Are you kidding me? Uh, it's going to be J Omega L. Okay, let me go one by one and explain this one for you guys. The J is not an I. Let me tell you something. For your mathematicians out there, eyes, we use eyes. For uh, imaginary numbers, as you may have known, but in the engineering realm, we like to use J's because we, we have J's on our feet. And uh, one fun fact is that I don't dot my I's. So I do dot my J's, though. Uh, the weird thing, weird, uh, that's an actual fact. I don't dot my I's. That's the, one of the weirdest things I've, I've noticed. Someone told me that it's funny that I don't dot my I's, but I dot my J's. Anyway, um, J is just imaginary number. Omega angular frequency or frequency blah 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 we're given that radians per second beautiful l is the magnitude of the inductance which is two millihenries of course um so uh, we just plug in for that uh, j is still imaginary number whoop de doo uh, square root of negative one never going to change that one and then omega is one thousand one hundred thousand i should say and then uh, the inductor is to a millihenry. So if I do this correctly, it's 0 0.002 henrys. And then let's see what we get there. So that's basically 2 over 1,000. That's J2000, I believe, if I did my simple arithmetic correctly. I probably won't. Someone will tell me in the comments I did I did it wrong. I did it wrong. Uh, I did it wrong. Um, but go ahead and tell me that. But the uh, one thing I forgot to tell you is that this thing is in series, so impedance, like any other resistor circuit that has series components or series resistors, we just add them up. We just add those bad uh, bad boys up. So 1,000 ohms or resistance or impedance is just a natural number, so we keep that on the real side. And then, uh, you know, if you don't want to keep it real, you know, keep it fake 100, well, Actually, we're going to keep it fake 2,000 because we have an imaginary number over here, 2,000J. So this is going to be, I almost wrote a square root sign. Uh, that's going to be your impedance of this simple RL combination circuit. Whoa, 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 whoa. I must be tripping. Uh, before you guys comment in the video, it's actually 1,200. Uh, I, got, I got it. Don't worry. I did the math right. Trust me.